Learning more this morning about the horrific mass shooting at a Georgia high school that claimed the lives of two 14 year old students and two teachers. 14 year old suspect now in custody. Law enforcement now saying he was on their radar last year. Erica Ritchie live in studio with the latest. Yeah, guys, another tough one. The Winder community in Atlanta grieving this morning as they do so. We're getting more insight into the teen who caused them this grief. As a 13-year-old last year, the FBI in Georgia linked him to online threats to shoot up a school. He denied those threats, and police say there was no probable cause for arrest. So let's fast forward now to just before 1030 yesterday morning. Police say 14-year-old Colt Gray opened fire at Appalachia High School. That's just about an hour outside of Atlanta. Investigators still working to figure out how the teenager got the AR style weapon into that school building, but we do know he was confronted by school resource officers almost immediately after those first shots rang out. And our law enforcement analyst Stephen O'Donnell says that likely made all the difference, not only in keeping a bad situation from becoming worse, but from preventing more tragedies like this in the future. By all accounts, this student school resource officers arrested this person. They had probably every right to use deadly force and neutralize that suspect. They did not. So the, they'll probably get some intelligence from this suspect to figure out what his motive was, and then they'll learn and other schools will learn uh, what to do. Now he is being charged with murder and as an adult, even though he's only 14 years old. In the meantime, at least nine other individuals, including eight students and one teacher, were taken to area hospitals in Georgia with injuries. Good news this morning, though, guys, they are expected to make a full recovery. Live in studio, Erica Ritchie, 12 News.